What's up guys, uh, this is Ninja Turtle, and I want to give you a quick little video and show you how awesome Squirrel Girl is in Lego Marvel's Avengers. So right now I'm just showing off that she can throw squirrels. Now this is not something new, she can do that in Lego uh, Marvel superheroes, but just going through everything that she's got that ability still. Now, if you hold down the circle button, I'm playing on PlayStation, she can do this, uh, well, I don't really even know what it is, but she's summoning a bunch of squirrels, and I assume that they can be used on a, a bunch of enemies at one time. Now, here, she can super jump, which is new. I'm pretty sure that's not in LEGO or Marvel Super Heroes. Uh, she, you, you can hold down the jump button and charge your jump. And she does a huge jump into the air, and it's absolutely awesome. Now, <clears throat> real quick, I'm going to show you that that's not something that every character can do. So, one of my other favorite characters in this game is Quicksilver, but he can't charge his jump. I just love the way he looks. Um, he just really looks great in this game. He's fun to use, but yeah, again, not everyone can do a charge jump. Now, uh, of course, Quicksilver doesn't have super strength, but Luke Cage does. But Luke Cage cannot do a charge jump, and I'm just showing you that now. Um, there are just a small handful of characters that can do a charge jump. So right now, I'm going to quickly show you someone else that can do a charge jump. And as soon as I get there, and that character is Hulk. So here is what Hulk looks like when he does a charge jump. And you got that cool splash effect. Now going back to Squirrel Girl, here's her charge jump one more time. And she also has a splash effect, but just obviously she's not as big as Hulk. But there you have it. Now if you hold down triangle button, she will summon her own Hulk Buster armor. Basically the Hulk Buster armor, but it looks like a squirrel. And it has a tail. And has an acorn blaster. And looks really awesome. So again, she can transform into this, just hold down the triangle button, and then she can also shoot acorns, obviously it's an acorn gun. Uh, you can target all your enemies, or whatever object you like for these acorns. She also is capable of charging her jump in this form, but when she does, she starts to fly. So that's awesome. The Hulkbuster armor, I don't even know if they're calling you know, what they call it in the game or even if it exists in the comic books. I, I read the comics. I, I love it. I do highly recommend her uh, current run of comic books, but I don't think this has happened. I think this is something special for the game uh, and I highly appreciate it. Uh, if you don't know anything about Squirrel Girl, she is a character that is just absolutely ridiculous. She's powerful, but like... She's beaten Galactus, she's beaten Doctor Doom, she's beaten Thanos, she's beaten MODOK, she's beaten uh, all these characters, all these evildoers that save the day. And all she is just a squirrel girl, she has powers of squirrel. So they write her to be ridiculous, but all of it's canon and it's so fun and she's one of my favorite characters. Here I am just taking out a few enemies, just showing you how the acorn gun works again. But just having fun with this game, and I love it, and uh, I do want to play more. And uh, this is going to wrap up the video, but I'll see you guys later. Peace.